What's going on, guys? CryptoWick here, back at it again with another video on Era of Conquest. Uh, all right, let's get right into it. So, this is going to be a continuation to my Rush Rankings mini series as we just finished day four. And guess what your boy got today? Um, we did it. <laughs> we finally got Alex uh, on this account. Uh, you know, unfortunately, I wasn't able to stay fully free to play. Uh, I was I, I didn't even have to purchase the daily bundle. I just did it so I, I could secure my uh, my ranking. I believe that I was like rank three at the time and uh, or no, not rank three. I'm sorry. I was like rank six at the time. Uh, so I had to make the purchase in order to get, you know, high enough in the hero rankings to guarantee a top five position. Uh, you know, this came with uh, the full Alex along with 10 uh, heads and five legendary heads, five epic heads, some armors and uh, a, a skill set chest. Um, so that was, you know, that that was not very difficult to do. Uh, this account has been pretty much free to play thus far, other than the daily bundle and the Leo bundle that was purchased. Um, you know, I'm trying to keep this as free to play as possible, but spending a little bit of money definitely does help um anyway let's move on to day five so day five is the skill enhancement this is literally co uh just the coins consumed by 18 skills uh as you can read down here what this means is that you have to focus all of the gold that you have into the first uh set of uh 18 skills that you have give me one second this being right here so Every hero has three skills. Um, so to focus on the top 18, I think it's the top six heroes. Yeah, let's see, three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18. Yeah, so you're gonna wanna focus on the on the skills of your top six heroes. Um, I would definitely recommend to, you know, either A, stay under level 14 and just go into level 13. So by that, I mean, don't upgrade this to level 14 because this consumes quite a bit of gold uh so what i'm what i'm saying is you want to try to stay level four versus me that i'm level five that you know that, that consumed quite a bit of gold which i could have put into uh the skills instead you know to kind of give me a little bit be better of a boost uh but i think we know we've been doing really good on, on this server thus far and i do definitely think that we're going to be able to maintain top 10 here with the skill enhancements um some of the things that you can do uh to get a little bit more gold and this is also to kind of go over the relic event a little bit uh when you come in here you definitely only want to buy the blue and the red chests for some reason i, I don't know what the reason was but I, when i first started the game there was a lot of people that told me not to get the blue chests but i was able to get saladin and i want to say the first like 20 or 30 pulls uh here i just got another uh you know leonidas out of a blue chest so these blue chests are definitely definitely well worth it and also this event is very long uh for the first relic hunt that appears so i do definitely recommend to let this refresh on its own uh, simply because you're going to be saving quite a bit of gems and again this event is long enough for you to be able to refresh it on its own and you to be able to go through quite a bit of oh, excuse me Whew. quite a bit of these um awakening stones you know uh real quick guys make sure that you guys are following subscribing and you know leaving a comment hitting that thumbs up button it definitely helps with the youtube algorithm and you know getting this video out there to more people that might just be finding this game and or you know people that have been looking for content like this um but anyway once you guys do that definitely don't forget to check out our discord uh sorry i kind of lost track track of uh oh my goodness anyways let's keep going so here I, I'm going to just refresh it for this, for, you know, the sake of the purposes of this video, but I definitely do recommend it just kind of let that refresh on its own simply again, because this is a pretty long event. So, you know, there's not much point in, uh, refreshing it. Also, oh, for the skill enhancement event, you can also get gold out of these chests here. Let's go ahead and do it one more time. All right, cool legendary hero badge that makes it kind of worth it. Lifesaver, awesome. 
all right so that's gonna be it i'm gonna be saving the rest of my gems for when it refreshes on its own um but yeah so you can you can also get a little bit of gold through here uh the other thing that i definitely do recommend from day three or day four i'm sorry into day five is trying to save up some of your relic hits so that you can go ahead and hit the rank uh the ranked guardians before anything but um because these give you uh quite a bit more gold uh and you know you want to try to hit these as, as, as uh the, the higher the better just to, to get more and more gold um as far as gold comes though I, I don't think that there's way too many ways to get gold you can obviously get gold from the gold mine uh i want to say in one of these events somewhere in here the level up gifts i believe that you get gold through some of these yeah so see here you get some gold to level seven you get a little bit of gold uh i want to say that I, I just got some gold too but it might have been at some other point here let me see let me double check i do hope that these the that this little mini series has been helping some of you guys out uh I, you know, I really do appreciate all the comments that I've been getting in the, in the comment section, all the love, man, uh, to my discord, you know, my, my, the community that we've got building up, we got a great, great, great team going, uh, you know, we're, we're really building a, a nice little family, um, on the discord. So don't forget to check us out there. Yeah. Let me see. I hope I don't have anything crazy on here. Um, but yeah, guys, this is our discord right here. Um, you know we have a, a lot of guides uh, a lot of guides to come we're going to be adding you know quite a bit of information in here uh it's all going to be free you know and then we're also going to be adding some crypto related stuff uh if you guys are interested in the crypto markets um you know i'm going to be posting quite a bit of information in there um but yeah guys definitely you know give us a uh, give us sorry give us um man check us out on discord <laughs> you know uh so these videos are definitely going to be raw and unedited for the time being as i'm waiting for uh, a laptop to get here a laptop of which i was supposed to have gotten today but there was a couple of problems <laughs> shout out to my boy uh, uh technic man the guy's been fucking amazing uh special shout out to sapphire i know she doesn't even watch these videos but you know special shout out to her and to, you know, my little interns, we got Techie, Riz, and Mux. I appreciate you guys, man. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that I covered everything that I was planning on covering in this video. Um, I know that I was looking at where other areas you're able to get golden. And I do not think that there's many more areas other than the relics. Um, but yeah, and then uh, some of these, I believe, that also give some gold but i don't think there's any any other place that you get gold really um gold is a pretty scarce commodity early on in the game uh and then until you eventually max everything out and it kind of comes you know pretty easily um but yeah guys uh, i hope you guys enjoyed the video uh like i said before don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you enjoyed come back soon thanks